putting algorithms are a really important question uh, uh, with respect of uh, interviews. So uh, let's have a look at the selection chart. It's quite easy. Basically, we uh, from an array we find the minimum and put it at the start of the index, and then we sort uh, look for the minimum, the rest part of the array, and then we put it at the next starting index. So this is how selection sort is done, and basically uh, in our function we have three uh, variables. So uh, basically we have uh, two for loops, and I. Uh, basically minimum will have the index of the i so for i equals zero minimum is zero and at this point we will start from traversing from the next index of the minimum uh, or i and uh, so it's j is equals to i plus one till the end of the array and we will traverse the uh, 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 the array and we'll look for that whether if there is another value which is uh, less than the uh, in this case zero it's minimum index and if there is we will uh, put this failure in the um, uh, in the minimum index, and once we have traversed the whole array, we would uh, replace the uh, i -th, or in case this case zeros index with the minimum uh, value, and the minimum value will have the uh, zeroth index value. So again, for i is equals to uh, one, minimum is one, and we will traverse from uh, two till the end, second position till the end of the array. So, because we know that the, uh, all the previous uh, array is um, sorted, and again the same is then traverse once, and the minimum is replaced with the uh, uh, ith uh, index of the array. And this is a simple print function in which we are printing an array, and here you can see an array is passed. And then print function is called. Here we're just calling the selection sort function and uh, then printing the array again. So let's have a look at the output of this um, program. So this is the initial uh, array and this is after sorting. So 